Hello, how are you guys doing? Thank you very much for being here. And I have to tell you, I have a pretty nice haul, which I love it. And I hope that you love it as much as I have been loving it. And we will start with the Isle of Arts and Crafts. And I'm going to tell you that I found these mirrors, which I can't flash it because I know it's going to bother you. And I also picked up four of them. So, of course, they're going to be going on for a DIY that I'm planning on doing. I also found this right here. And I thought it was so cute. So, I picked this up. I like the glitter. I like the whole colors gathered together. Blessings. I just love the whole thing. So this is another thing that I actually really liked. It has a little pumpkin and everything, so I can use it for Thanksgiving. And then from the same aisle, I actually picked up a whole bunch of paint for the house. And I, we use it buying all those little statues that they have at the dollar store. So I buy her a whole bunch of paints in different colors. I mean, I bought tons, tons and tons of colors. And I actually bought the real big ones because you also could find these right here that it's actually a smaller size. So I picked up two of the smaller ones and the rest are all from the big ones. And I actually bought two, four, six, eight, nine nine big ones and these two so and i've already shown you guys that i have the little palettes where we can do the put the colors and everything so she can play but i also found from the crafter squares these paints right here of course these have a little less but everything is okay so I found these color and these have glitter in it and everything. I really love this color like I love this other one. So I have them all in here because if we want to do our arts and crafts, I have basically almost all the colors. I think I need white if I'm not wrong. No, I, there's a white one back there. So I basically have all the colors. So we have had fun with these. I'm just going to throw them all here because I want to know where that I have them so when I need to use them. So I got a pretty big bag. And also picked up this thing right here where you can actually put all the colors. So instead of using the trays that I normally have, we can actually use these. And these are the trays that I actually bought last time. So this time I actually found this one. Oh, here's my red one. I'm telling you, I have things all over. My daughter's ready to do her painting and everything. And so I've been telling her that she has to hold off until I get all my stuff ready. And then she can have them. But she loves to paint. And I actually like to sit down and paint with her too. Because they have pretty cool things that you can actually paint. Then I also picked up this right here. And this is how it looks. So you can actually use it to put all your stuff in it, like your brushes, and even for the Cricut things, you know, the weeders and everything. So you can use it for different things. And this one, how you use it, it has this weird thing right here, so it won't be opening or anything. You actually have to sit it and just twist it, and you twist it all the way until you get it all the way in. So basically, if you want to have it this size, you can, but if you actually keep it this way, you can keep things that are pretty longer, and it won't move. So wherever you want to leave it, it actually works perfectly. So you can make it big, or you can make it smaller. So... 
I regret probably not getting another one because they are pretty cool. Because I can use one for the brushes when my daughter does her painting. And the other one is I can use it for my Cricut. Okay. So after I showed you everything with painting and all those things, I have to share something that I actually bought a whole bunch of them. And I'm going to tell you because these are super cool. Touch Plus. And these wipes are super awesome. And it has 160 wipes. And as you can see, the tub's pretty big. I have them in the restrooms. I have them in the garage. I have it in the kitchen. I have them all over the house. I bought a lot of these. And this time that I went, I actually picked up some more. Because they are awesome. And they do a great job. I'm going to tell you they're not dry. They're pretty humid and they clean and leave your kitchen pretty nice. So lately, I've been cleaning my countertops with this perfect product that I'm sure that if you get this, you are going to love it like I have. So I have it in the restroom and you know, you wipe everything and it keeps everything nice and clean. And these tubs are pretty cool. And it says in here that it has no oil. Uh, no grease, there's no glue, no paint, no food stains. So basically, you can use it for everything you want, and they're pretty safe. And it actually says not to throw it in the toilet. But I'm pretty sure that you, there is no need to be having them in your toilet because I'm pretty sure it will damage them. So... I'm going to say love it. Another thing that I picked up, and it's because I already have the idea here of what I want to do. And it's these beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous butterflies. So there are two different types of flowers. I mean flowers, butterflies. And so I already have the idea in my head of how I want to do it. But sometimes you just have to have a little bit of time to do all your stuff. So I will get into that and you guys will see it because you guys already know that I do DIYs. Like I talk about perfumes and we talk about dollar store. Another product that I found and that I only found it at this place and that these were the only two that they had. So maybe they had more, but I didn't get to see them and I probably just found these two. And it's these little mugs that I think they're super cool. Like for a hot chocolate, even for a coffee. They are pretty big. My hand's pretty big, so this is big. I mean, I have here my coffee from Starbucks. And as you can see, this is a venti. So they're pretty tall, okay? They're not bad at all. And the only two that I found, that's what I picked up and I thought in my mind for hot chocolate for my kids this would be perfect so and another thing i think i see in my eyes something related to cheerleading so i don't know if you guys can see the same thing that i am seeing but i thought that they were pretty cool okay so now we're gonna jump in into the makeup aisle and it's one of the areas where I actually go before I go to any other part. So the first thing I do as I walk in at any of the dollar stores is go immediately to the makeup. And once I find whatever I want from there, I start going to different places to find different things or just to see what they have. But the eye makeup, I'm going to tell you, I actually love to go there. And yes, you can find a lot of things. Sometimes you will find that in all different places, there are basically just a repeat, repeat, repeat of the same thing. So I just love and enjoy going in and finding things. And especially when you find something that it's name brand. One thing that I actually found, and it's this right here, Pink Sugar. And it's a scrub rub, scrub rub. Let 
lip scrub and this is how it actually looks it's pink and I've heard a lot of nice comments from people now I really haven't tried it but now that the winter is coming in we know that our lips are going to start getting dry and so you need to have them all nice and moist so that's when I'm actually going to be able to try it and see what I think about it okay from the kids aisle and I was about to pay when I actually found these poppets which my daughter is addictive and it's like a little shirt you can see that it's a little shirt so I thought it was pretty cool and it has like something so you can hang it from like a cheap keychain so I picked up they actually had different ones I think there was like a circle a little square like this blue one right here there was like two or three things but I just picked that one so another thing that I picked up and I don't have my iPad here it was this little disco ball that if you connect it and you're playing music this is playing the same rhythm in lights that your music and it's pretty cool and as you can see this is how it looks um, it doesn't fit my iPhone, but it fits my iPad. So I thought it was pretty cool and I really like it to be very honest. Another thing that I picked up is these pearls. They're like salmon color. I say it's salmon. And I actually picked, picked these beads because I am planning of doing the DIYs so when I find things I just pick them up and I know that maybe in a moment I won't know what to do but something will come up so those are some of the things now Halloween is already done and if you go to any of the dollar stores that you can't find anything no candy no nothing so I was really impressed because I actually have seen other people talk about a lot of their eyelashes from Ion, Ioni, however it's pronounced it. And I really didn't have the chance to see the other ones. I know there is different ones, but I actually found these two. So I picked them up. To be very honest, I think they are super, super long. So I don't know if I'll use them or not. But like I always say, for a dollar. What else can you ask for? Then I have from the name brand Wet and Wild this blush and it's in an orange coral color. So I thought this was pretty nice for those persons who don't like like a pink color. And I'm one of those. I don't like really pink. I like red lipsticks and I like pink lipsticks. But when I am going to put blush I feel that if I use a pink blush, I look like a little clown. And this color, I think I will like it. Now, I'm not sure if I'll keep it or I'll put it on the giveaway because I don't know if I mentioned at the beginning of the video, I am doing giveaways. So make sure that you are subscribed, that you hit the notification bell, and that you leave me a message, hashtag your name, whatever you want to say. So you can be entering into this giveaway. Okay. So we have a couple of things from Heart Candy. And we also have one from the Elf family. And it's this lipstick that it's actually a pretty nice pink. Um, I was thinking of putting on the giveaway. But I like my lips to be in a hot pink, orangey. So I was debating and I said, I think I'm going to keep this one. So I will be able to swatch it for you. And that is how it looks.
it is a gorgeous nice color this is a little pinkish i feel like it has a little orange in it also so it looks pretty nice and i think i like it and if i don't like it i'm pretty sure my daughter would take over it because she is actually been taking over all my lipsticks and everything then i have this one also from heart candy And it says all matte up hydrating lip station and this seems to be a kind of brownish color so I try to open it but it's pretty hard it's super super sealed and this one is from what number 1024 so it seems to be a nice brown it's not so dark I actually bought one that it was dark way darker and I didn't like it. My lips kind of look black. And I also, when I used it, I made I actually made a video. And when I saw the video, I really didn't like it that because of the color of the lipstick. I'm more of reds, oranges, pinkish, even browns, light colors, but that dark one, not really. Another color that I think I am going to like, it's this one from Brevlon. And this one is actually, let me see if I can see the number, 525. And I actually have two. And as you can see, it's actually a similar color to the one that I have just showed you. As you can see the color by the, right there. I don't know if you can see it. Maybe let me turn it around a little. So they're basically the same color. Then I also picked up another one from Revlon and this one is actually 900 and I'm gonna say this one's way like redder and I think it's another color that I am going to like if you compare them this one seems to be darker can you see that right there so they are pretty cool they are not the same color so We'll see how it goes. Then I have from Heart Candy, and I bought two of these, and this is a matte bronze bronzer, and this one is, is a 19, no, $17.92. And this one actually will help you to look very bronze. It's gonna give you some color, or it's gonna put you some color. So I actually picked up two and as you can see they are going to be a little darker than my skin so i am going to love this and it's super sealed and this is how it looks from the back then i have another one right here from heart candy and i think i am going to love this color to be very honest and this one is a where is the number i cannot see it i'm sorry but i'm gonna swatch it for you and that is how it looks and these are the kind of colors that I actually like and enjoy. And as you can see, this is the one that I just used. And the other one, it's this one right here. So this one's like more pinkish. This is more like a peachy color. So another one that I picked, and it was this one. And I liked it because it has a lip liner. So this one is actually a 15 29 and that's how it looks it's kind of a orangey dark color i'm gonna say that it has a little bit of like purple in it so it's not like completely red but it seems to be pretty cool and i think i'll enjoy this color 
Then I have another one from Hard Candy. And it's this right here. And I love these little pouches. Of course, it's the same, but this one, I like it just for the fact that it has a little pouch. And it also has that mirror that you can use. And this one is way darker than the one that I just showed you. They're just so hard to get out of these packages. And this is how it looks. And this is the other one that I just used. So it's just slightly darker. And I don't know if I told you what number this one is. This is a 1215. And let me swatch it for you. Oh, that's a nice brown. I like it. That is nice. So this is more of a brown and the other one's really peachy. So... That is from Heart Candy. And I, like I said, I love the whole box and how it's actually presented to you. I think it's really cool. And it's called Velvet Mousse. So if you like the color, Velvet Mousse would be perfect for you. Then I got another one from Heart Candy and this is number 1378. And this is actually a lipstick. Let me swatch it for you. Ooh, that's dark, but it's nice. It looks darker here. The ones I put it in camera, it looks nice. It's a nice color. It's not bad and it's very glary. Well, this is from Hard Candy. So if you like purples, you might find it. They had a whole bunch. And then I have another one, and this one is $13.95. And I like this color. This is super, super light and nice. I like that. That is so nice, and it has a lot of glitter and everything. This is so nice. And this is how it looks. A very nice peachy color it is so nice then I have another one and this one is actually a 1373 and this is how it looks look at how it, that glitter shines and it makes it look so nice so let me swatch it for you I like this. I like this one. And I was thinking I wasn't going to like it. Just look at that. Check it out. How nice. So all these three that I just shared with you, let me tell you how they shine and how they look so beautiful. These are more like a matte. But this is awesome. Then I have another one. And this is also from Heart Candy, and it says All Mad Up. And this one is number 1783, and this is how it looks. And if I can just open it. Okay, so this is how it looks. Let me swatch it for you. Ooh, that's a nice color too. So I like that too. It's a nice brown. And it, when I actually was doing it like that in my skin, like it's super, super soft and creamy. And you only have to push it from the back so you can get all that coming out. So push it back in. And this is how it looks. 
So if you find it, you will like it if you like browns. A really nice. This is the one I just put on that it was this one right here. And then look at this one. They're very similar, but this one has a lot of glitter. My last one from Heart Candy. And I think that it's going to be one of my favorite ones. And I, of course, I have so much lipsticks that they're just going to go bad because I have so many. And let me swatch it. Let me tell you, very creamy. Very, very creamy. Very nice. And this is completely in oranges. Like in oranges. And this is actually a 1760. And this is gorgeous. Okay. If you're a person who likes orange colors, that would be your color for you. So there you go. All the swatching of the lipsticks I actually bought. The only one I was able to swatch, oh, and the Revlons, because they were kind of hard to open them up. But this one, for some reason, I feel it's going to be exactly the same color as this one, just different presentation. Okay, well, that will be all for today, and I hope that you like what I just offer you. Hopefully, that if you go and shop around, you will find at least one of these, and... I know that not all of the stores actually have the same things. This haul is actually from $3 stores, if I'm not wrong. So sometimes you have to go around and shop around because you will not find everything in one certain place. You have to go around and check out what you want. So this is all for today. And I hope you guys like it. And I would like to hear from you guys. And do not forget that we have that giveaway. So if you are interested, please sign in. And please set that notification bell so you know every time I upload videos. Thank you very much. And we will see you next time. With love and care, Gladys. So for this giveaway, we have two of these pads right here. Then I have these pads in here. They have their pen and everything. I have this from Wet n Wild. I have these dry shampoo and a vitamin C dry shampoo. Then I have Be Kind or Bus Off. We got those stickers there. And then we have this right here for your flat iron. So this is all in the giveaway. So if you're interested, you already know what to do. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Hashtag your name.